Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got a video um, to share with you. Uh, Judy from Judy and Canal Art had gotten in touch with me and asked me if I'd like to join this collab. And this collab is about your childhood. So I've got a lot of products and I'm just going to zip on into it before I forget. Thank you Judy for inviting me to do this collab. I will have a link down below for everyone involved. I would love for you to go check all of them out. Um, these are always such great fun and you get to see different people's takes on a theme and it's just really fun to do. So I'm going to show you the products I'm using real quick. I'm going to be using Dainty Digits Glitter Be Gone, a peel off face coat. I will be using the OPI Black Onyx. I will also be using OPI and this one is all I want for Christmas is OPI, and it was from the Gwen Stefani collection. I'll be using several stamping plates. Let me turn some lights off so I don't blind everyone. This one is Bundle Monster 424, and I'll be using the roller skate. The next one is Bundle Monster 421, and I'm going to be using this film image and also this movie reel image. This plate is Bundle Monster 601, and I will be using the vinyl records. The next is a mash plate, and I will be using the Little Pony over here. And this is mash plate number 42. And the next one is a Wistonia plate, and this is Wistonia W103. And I'll be using this little cheerleader right over here. I will be using my Faber Nail Scraper and my crystal stamper from Born Pretty. And I will be using a stamping polishes from Nicole Diary, the black and the white. And these are NS02 and NS01. So, let me get it all together and we'll hop on into it. Okay, my friends, I am back. I decided to make a change. I added a color to my middle nail and this one is also from OPI. And this is the Alpine Snow. Not my favorite white, but uh, we're using it today. And I topped everything off with posh so that it would dry down so I could do my stamping. And if my camera would act nice, we'll get started. I'm going to do this little roller skate in white. I used to go roller skating a whole lot when I was a young girl. It was one of our favorite activities. I'm going to clean off that little bit of excess with some tape. And here we go. Get this thumb down here. And I think I'm going to redo that one. I'm not real, real happy with how it picked up. It's kind of on the corner, so it's a little harder for me to get a good scrape. But this actually looks like the old roller skates that I wore. You know, the ones that had four wheels. They weren't the newfangled ones. Okay. And I guess we're going to go with that one. It looks pretty good. And I'm going to pop that one right there in the middle. But me and my girlfriend used to love to go roller skating to plop that plate over. Next we're going to head on to the next childhood memory <laughs> and I'm going to use this plate with the, the film reel or the film look on it. The film strip or movie strip. And I'm also going to stamp that one in the white. And I'm going to do that one down the center of my nail to the best of my abilities. And there we go. And from the same plate, I'm going to use that little movie reel. And I'll do it in white also. There we go. Quick scrape. Pick up. And I'm just going to place that right there. So there's my little movie. We used to love to go to the movies, but when I was a kid, it was kind of a super big treat. We didn't go actually to the movie theater a whole lot. We had to wait for um, 
you know, things, movies to come on TV. And one of my biggest memories is every year waiting on Wizard of Oz to come on. It came on every year, and I always looked forward to it. Movies were a big thing. The next one I'm moving on to is the vinyl record, and I'm going to stamp that one in black. I was huge, huge into music when I was young. I still love music, all kinds of music. But um, my music wasn't on a CD, and cassettes came out when I was a teenager, <laughs> the easier, easier to buy. But a lot of my stuff was actually on vinyl, and I still own a lot of vinyl. So I'm going to do the vinyl over the vinyl records over my middle nail. There we go. I loved, I had 45s and 33s and I still have them <laughs> and, and I still actually have something that I can play them on. Okay, the next finger is a black finger and I'm going to use this plate here. I'm going to turn my towel and I'm going to do this little pony. I had a pony. Now mine was actually a little black pony named Midnight. And I saved up my money and I bought him myself and I loved him very much. Um, I got too big for him and eventually he became like my grandpa's puppy dog. He followed my grandpa everywhere and he loved being treated like a puppy dog. And his name was Midnight. He was a very sweet baby. So there's my furry white pony. I had to change his color. Midnight, of course, was not white. He was solid black with two white lines behind his ears. And that was my pony one. And another really great childhood memory was I was a cheerleader one year. And the reason why my nails are red and white, and of course I had to throw the black in because it just worked, but um, our school colors were red and white. I was a cheerleader for one year. So, still have my my cheerleading outfit, but no pom-poms, they did not make it. I'm going to put this little cheerleader on my pinky. Oh, there we go. So we got the cheering, the pony, the vinyl, the movies, and roller skating. All of my favorite things from my childhood. Well, maybe not all of them, but a lot of them. I'll be right back. We're going to do a little bit of clean up and top coat. Alright, I have very, very little cleanup to do, so I'm going to see what I can get done here with this little piece of tape. And, uh, I'm not really worried about those right there. I have one little piece on this finger, on my pointer finger, I want to try to get without taking all of it. Alrighty, so we're going to head on into top coating these. And of course, I will be using Posh most favorites. I'm going to seal that design all in. And I really thought this was a great theme for a collab. Judy, <laughs> every time I've ever been involved with a collab with her, I've always enjoyed the um, theme that she has come up with. So here we go. We're going to top coat the rest of these. And that black onyx from OPI, it's been a long time since I used it. I'm still very impressed. I did two coats of everything, the Alpine Snow, the black onyx, and the All I Want for Christmas is an OPI. These are doing very nicely. Oh, got a little tiny bit of smearing. We need to be a little more careful. We're going to cap that in. And anybody that has ever watched my videos knows I'm an orange wood stick nut. <laughs> Always break it out. Here we go. We're going to cover our pony and some top coat. Mm -hmm. 
very cute. And one more little cheerleader. So, there we go. And there you have it, my finished manicure. We've got the cute little roller skate. We've got the cute little movie theme. And we have our vinyl and our pony and our cheerleader. So, once again, I would like to remind you to go check out all the other channels and watch all the other videos. Show these other ladies some love. I'm sure their designs will be just amazing. So, thank you for watching, and until next time, be good to yourself. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.